Christine Lagarde, you spent a day here at the World Economic Forum meeting key business leaders. What have you discussed? First of all, it was a real pleasure being here. Uh, being a member of the French government as Minister of Economy, Finance and Employment, I don't have the luxury um, to spend enough thinking time with such a group of smart people. Second, it was a pleasure because a lot of them were my friends from previous life, and it was nice to see them again. We discussed, to come back to your point, uh, we discussed issues of the sustainability of growth in the economy. I was able to offer comments concerning the status of France and the number of reforms that we have already implemented and executed upon in the last 100 days, because today is the 100th day of President Sarkozy's uh, presidency. And I was able to certainly articulate uh, the path that we want to follow, which is going to take us from reform to perform. In business circles, France doesn't generally have a very positive image. Did you address this issue? I think I did uh, implicitly by indicating the uh, number of reforms that we have already conducted, uh, the trend that we are determined to follow, and the focus that we have now on productivity, work ethic, um, and playing our part in the global economy and focusing, I think, very much on work, innovation and training. You're a regular at the annual meeting in Davos. How important is it for you to interact with the business community? It is critical. Uh, while we're not necessarily pursuing the same interest, uh, the business community pursues the interest of its own community and each head of company pursues the interest of its company. That's fair. Governments pursue another type of interest that have to do with the general public interest. But clearly the two have to intersect and it's by finding out what the intersections are that we can actually bring societies forward uh, by helping the business community to do its job uh, to create employment, to create wealth, to develop value, to innovate and to cause progress to be made and by including as many people as possible as far as governments are concerned and by making society more opulent and more opulent to all. Is there anything that you have learned in Davos that helps you in your new role as Minister of Economy? I've learned a lot from Davos uh, over the years. Uh, as you said, I've, I've, I've been coming to the um, annual meeting in, in, in Davos uh, regularly for the last seven years or so. And I've always learned something. Uh, when I was a, a baby attendee, attendee, I was you know, going from one meeting to another, one breakout session to another, just picking bits and pieces here and there. Uh, as I sort of progressed in my own professional life, uh, I've participated more actively by offering whatever I could contribute and also listening very carefully to what others have to contribute. And what I've always found fascinating is the cross-section of different people and the, the sort of the plea for diversity where um, very, very different people with completely diverse backgrounds actually come together and offer what they have learned from their own life and from their own expertise to the group at large with a view to just improving the world. Davos has a bad image in France. Why is that? What do you think? Um, I think Davos can, can improve its image uh, in the French general overall community. I think it has a good image in the French business community. I mean, there is quite a number of French business people who attend uh, the Davos meetings and who participate. Um, we French tend to be a little bit inhibited uh, by the fact that a lot of other people we perceive speak English better than we do. And English being the lingua franca, uh, it makes it a bit more complicated for, uh, for us. I hope that gradually goes away I think the fact that our government is generally supportive of international experience, benchmarking, uh, including foreigners in think tanks that are currently working on the reform program, should lead Davos to being far more popular than it was before. Will we see you again and President Sarkozy in Davos next year? You will definitely see me, um, no doubt. Uh, and I will try to convince my president that it is, it is certainly worth um, the time and the effort because there's a lot, lot to be gained out of the exercise.